All right, hello. This is um, how I store villainous. Uh, so a common issue is well, since as of right now there are four uh, boxes that this game fits in right now, because there's the main game and then the three expansions. Um, I often have a hard time taking this over to somebody's house to play it, uh, because it's just a lot to take. So I decided to do some research and find out what I could do to fit all this into one solid container that I can carry around with me. So I originally was looking at getting like a wooden box, but wooden boxes would be uh, too expensive with all the stuff in it because the wooden box would just be empty and then I would have to make these dividers. So that that was too expensive so I just decided on getting this um, art box well it's for art supplies and stuff like that but um, I'm using it for this so it's it says down here it says art bin um, I don't really know exactly what brand it is but I found it at my local Hobby Lobby or you can um, order it off Amazon too I think it was about uh, 30 bucks it comes with these dividers so you get this big main one and then you get um, six uh, extra ones to divide it into quarters but what I have is I have um, or divided into eighths so I have an eighths over here and then I have this big section and this little one here so yeah let's open it up Okay, so inside I have, um, I have all the villain guides in here, as well as all of the um, reference cards, so that it's just all here in this bag. This was originally um, in the, the main expansion, the bag that held these originally, I just combined them all into one. In here, I have all the game boards. I'm going to try and make a talk box to fit these all in, but since none of those exist right now, I'm going to have to make it by hand by measuring and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, this is this is why this is so big cuz it only fits in here like that. Um it's not a perfect fit, but hopefully with the tuck boxes it'll um, be a bit more uh, safe. In this section down here, I have all of the game pieces, like I've Corolla the Will here, um, Ursula. It's it's just the section with all the game pieces. Uh, that's really all there is to it. Um, in this section down here, I have the power um, cup, bowl, cauldron thing. Then I have all of the power down here too. I combined it from every game, so it's a lot. So. It's really not a pain if it's not in a bag because you just grab the bowl. Since there's so much of it, you can just grab a huge handful and just put it in there. Um, so that's not really a pain. Um, also, I have all of like the Fate tokens, Pete's tokens, Corolla Deville, all the lock stuff. So this is where like if you have a special um, gimmick like Pete, Corolla Deville. And whatnot it's all in here um, also the fate tokens are in there as well uh, in here I also have Radigan's objective card thing yeah and then Rapunzel's um, fate card basically it's just if it's cardboard it's in here I really should have Rapunzel sleeved or whatever but um, I haven't yet and then next, I have all of these tuck boxes. Um, this was off of the. This is off of a uh, website, I think. It's like a message board or something. I'll link it down in the description so you can find these yourself. But um, what I had to do was get some cardstock, preferably the more uh, durable cardstock, because thin cardstock would rip too easily so this is a uh, what one of them looks like so 
it looks really cool. It's got um, it's in this one's Yuzma, so it's got her villain card description. It's got her quote on there. It's got her name on the top. Um, the fate card backs that again. So it's just like a really cool um, tuck box, and I have one for every single villain in the game. Um, inside. I have all of the cards, obviously. Um, something I also did while making this box was buy some sleeves so that they can the cards can be protected. Um, so these are all sleeved. So these are all nice and protected and safe because they're all nice and sleeved. So that's pretty good. Um, the sleeves I bought were standard Ultra Pro penny sleeves. This one's a pack of 100. Um, I'll link the buyer I got these off of on Amazon. Um, they sell them in sets of 500, so I got two of them because um, in total there's like 640 something cards in the game. I could be wrong, but somewhere between 600 and 700, so I needed. A lot and it was cheaper to just buy two sets of 500 than try and buy um, two 300s and then a 100 or getting a 500 and then a 300 and plus I have quite a bit left over so if a new expansion comes out I'll have enough sleeves for that so that's good uh, and yeah, that's pretty much how I have this all set up. Um, the box is actually pretty good because it comes with a uh, comes with a handle, so you can just walk around with it like a briefcase. So it's like a nice one-handed um, experience. You don't have to like uh, carry it with both hands like you would all the other villainous, unless you're like really good at balancing things. But yeah, that's basically how I store my game so yeah I'll link everything that I got or use down below yeah if you have any questions or concerns uh, talk to me in the description and I will get back to you but yeah that's pretty much it thanks for watching